guys, I'm Murray from Van King and welcome to our YouTube channel. This is where we are going to fully demonstrate our bed system and steel slider for the Volkswagen Transporter range. We're currently waiting on Lynn and Anne coming all the way from Wales. I think they said it's about an eight hour round trip. They're coming up to have a short wheelbase combi system fitted. Funnily enough, their son was here about four weeks ago he got back home, mum and dad saw it and said we want one too. So they're on their way, so looking at the time, it should be here in about five minutes, so let's get on with that now. Right Lynn, this is your bed system fitted in here, okay. The advantage of our system is you can keep the retaining loops, a lot of the systems you lose them. Then you've got the slide in with an all it fibre board, which can come out like that. Okay, so we just put that to the side now. Okay. And then you'll see that you have the crossbars in there. Now this crossbar, all of the crossbars are fully removable. Okay, see that there. Okay. So that, and a good thing about them is they're, they're fixed. So they're bolted in, okay, and that crossbar can drop off. So anything you want, now that will stay in your van the whole duration now. Okay, so you can see you've got a full load space. Other systems out there only give you half foot space, but you're getting the full system with ours. Okay, so to put the crossbars back on, lock on like that, onto the bolt. And the good thing about these being secured by a fixing point, plumb and off, is that if you were in, unfortunately, if you had a, a bump or something that, that Nothing can come out, it's all secured in. So you've got all these crossbars, can be locked in like that, and the clamping knobs just go on and fix there. Okay. If you want to create a shelf, you can still create a shelf in your van. Okay, so the last one can go on like that. Basic structure in there. Okay. And then the phenolic ply we use birch plywood that can then lock in there. Okay, and that slides all the way to the back. And as you can see now, you've got two tier storage. We'll we'll get your mattress now, we'll get the secondary board. There's another board here behind us. Okay, and that creates the platform. Okay, so uh, and that's it. That's your platform ready to go before you put your mattress on. Okay, so you get it right over as far as you can, and that's when you put it in. But the other thing is, our mattress can sit right there. Okay, so when you put your seat back up, quite easily to do. Pop your seat up and it sits all neatly up there and that's a little parcel shelf in the back. Okay, so you've still got your storage space there. Mm -hmm. We've chosen a really nice quality, well that's what we produce, it's a nice, it's a German quality stretch vinyl so it's comfortable to lie on and the advantage of this now, that just slides out and it's end cut at the, on the frame so these boards can't come out and then that can safely store away like that. But that board then can, that can be removed and that creates your full depth so if you're getting dogs and things like that you can uh, still utilize your load space okay so then what we can do is pull that back out slide that back into the into there drop your seat down the seat drops down nicely like that Pull your mattress forward, flip it up, drop that in there, and that fits nicely in there, and then uh, as I say at the back, when that sits in there nicely like that, you can nicely pull out your tray, and you can put your hob or whatever you want to do on there, whether it's sandwiches or anything you're making, 
And then, as I say, when you want to put it back, you slide it under the bed. You want to make your bed up. Just in case you're grabbing that from there. And that side. Turn it over. And you've got a full piece of side side. Right, so if you want to move the whole system, just grab that. And then that can be stored in the mattress as well. And then these crossbars just fully removed then. And then you just repeat the process all the way down. space as quick as that and then again it's just a reverse process putting the uh, crossbars back on and then slide the matches back as we demonstrated earlier. Ask away. These vans you build them for us we design some Yeah it's only these that we do them for at the moment but we've been asked for a lot of people to do them in other vans so watch this space we might just do that in the future. Good idea, Mary. <laughs> okay, so as you can see, the, the structure becomes very firm once the uh, the clamps are in place. And the good thing about these being secured, as I've said once before, you don't want anything jumping out in the event of a, a bomb. My background's fire service, so I know what I'm talking about with that one. <laughs> so that, I'll just slide right forward there. Okay, so you can grab this other board. And that just slots into there. Nice and firm. And put the mattress up on its side. Put that in there. And then you've got your very nice comfy mattress there. If you want to make it up, you pull it down to make the bed up. But when you're in storage mode for driving, you can pull your uh, strap at the bottom of your seat and flip that back up. And then everything's nice and secure in there. And then you've still got your pull-out table for preparing food as such. But as you can see, it's been switched from a van to a day van in virtually a few minutes. Yeah, and as you can see, when it's all bolted down, all the crossbars, there's no movement there. Okay, so it's nice and solid. As you can see from watching the videos today, you can see that our system is so flexible. You can switch from a van, everyday use van, and then you can pop the bed down, and then you get the full use of your van, full depth, full space, in a matter of minutes. So thanks for taking the time to watch our videos. Feel free to subscribe. Until next time.